Hi guys, it's nice speaking with you today. I just want to show you a more yearly story biography. This is Wikipedia. Uh, you see? But let me read. Omoyele Shouri, born 16 February 1971, is a Nigerian human rights activist, pro-democracy campaigner, founder of online news agency, Sahara Reporters, and the presidential candidate for Africa Action Congress, EAC. Early life and education. Omoyele Shore is an indigen of Ilaje Ondo State in southwest Nigeria. Shore was born in the Niger Delta region of the country, where he was also raised in Polygamo's home with six children. At 12, he learned how to ride motorcycle so he could fish at the lake of the entire family before going to school every morning. You see? Omoyele is well known right now all over the world and is a son of nobody. Anybody can become whoever he wants to be if you work passionately towards it. You know? Show repaction and desire in media was propelled during the military rule in Nigeria. So study geography and regional planning at the University of Lagos from 1989 to 1995 with his academic program extended by two extra years. <laughs> this guy. After being expelled twice for political reasons and student activism, you know, he got expelled in the school for for always organizing the protest against the military rule. Wonderful. He was the president of University of Lagos Student Union Governance between 1992 and 1994, where he was keenly involved in anti courtism and anti-corruption advocacy. Shure hold master degree in public administration from Columbia University. That is Columbia University from US. Yeah. United States of America, to be precise. In 1989, he took part in students' demonstration protesting the condition of an International Monetary Fund, IMF, loan of $120 million to be used for Nigeria oil pipeline among the condition of IMF loan. Yeah to reduce the number of university in the country from 28 to 5. This is exactly what I don't understand right here. Why will the condition of giving loan be is to reduce the number of university from 28 to, to, to 5, you know? So relate 1,000, 5,100 students in protest against the Nigeria government 
1992. The protest resulted in the uh, police opening fire and seven people killed. So sad. Joe was arrested and tortured. Omoyelis was also involved in the demand for democracy government taking over military role in June 12, 1993. They resulted in several arrests, detention, and life threatening treatment by government officials. Uh, uh, this is a uh, Sarah reporters when uh, okay so we started so we started uh, Sarah reporters in a small room in Mahartan 2006 to fight against corrupt and wrong government practices so we reporter is supported by grants donated by the Ford Foundation and Umidaya Foundation as part of his policy. The medium does not accept adverts and financial support from Nigeria government. Uh, on February 25, 2018, Sowore announced his intention to run for president in the 2019 Nigeria general election in August 2018. He founded a political party, the African Action Congress AAC, for which he will run for the 2019 uh, election. On October 6, 2018, following successful primary election at the AAC National Convention, Omori Elise Ure emerged on challenge as a presidential candidate for the party. These guys have a history, man, you know? I just want to share with you those that doesn't know Omoy Elisha Ure very well. I just want to share with you his biography, how how he started from nothing, you know, and become and become so successful in life. You know. So let I would like I would like to show you this before before I leave you, let me not waste much of your time. Uh, Nigeria in diaspora elects uh, Sowore as president in a mock online uh, election. Uh, I, this is a, this is a from a pox. Ng. You know, so he was elected. Uh, okay, these are the the percentage. He, he won with a 81.3%. That was beautiful. He beat, uh, he beat Fela Durtoye, Mohamed Buhari, or Progressive Congress, Atiku Abubakar, uh, Saikin Slimangu, uh, and so on and so forth, you know. But uh, overall, he won with... Uh, 81.3 percent so that was cool uh go further okay this is the same thing oh these are our reporters uh so we already won the european coalition presidential online election so if you are just uh, visiting my <clears throat> if you are just uh, visiting our our YouTube channel for the first time. Please don't forget to subscribe before you leave, so that you can uh, 
be receiving every update and I will make sure I keep updating you of the ongoings in Nigeria. You know. Thank you very much. Thanks for watching. Oh, before I leave, I was also like to, to show you the live uh, the live broadcast of the uh, November first uh, election uh, uh, result announcement. Let me show you. You know, because of a uh, YouTube uh, regulation, I would just like like to end it there. You know, so thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.